Hey guys, this video is for those of you who purchased the extension controller. When I ship the machine out, I don't have that enabled. So I'm going to show you what you have to do to enable the controller. It's super simple, literally one thing you have to click and, and you're all set. So let me show you that now as usual. The first thing you want to do is press control shift escape. Then we're going to go down to new task. And if it doesn't already say Explorer, uh, type that in and hit OK. Now mine is already loaded in the background, so um, you will not get this window. You would actually get Windows loading in the background. So uh, give that, you know, like 30 seconds or so to, com to complete loading. Um, and then go ahead and highlight Hyperspin, do End Task, and it'll bring you right here. Uh, the next thing you want to do is you can either start it up from this shortcut here, Rocket Launcher, or down here in the taskbar, uh, this icon right here. Um, so let's go ahead and open that and let it finish opening. It takes a little bit of time to open. Okay, once it opens, if it asks you to um, install any updates, always say no, guys. Trust me on that one. It'll break a lot of things, so say no. Uh, let's go ahead and maximize this. All right, next up, you want to go to settings and you want to go to mapping and then you want to go to keyboard encoders right here, enabled, change the, that from false to true. And that is all you have to do. Okay, that's going to enable the support for the extension controller. Um, next up, you want to close this up. Let's go ahead and open Hyperspin again. There's a shortcut on the desktop here or again on the taskbar down here. Okay, now the next thing you have to do is with your keyboard or Xbox controller, just go ahead and scroll over to, let's do MAME because it's the first one on the list here. So we're gonna scroll over to MAME and you're gonna press the enter button to go in and then let's scroll down using the arrow keys up and down. I'm, I'm clicking the down arrow key right now. Uh, let's select 1942 and hit enter. And that's it. Once you do that, it's going to go ahead and program the uh, correct input to your extension. And you should already be able to play this game. And then when you exit this game, it'll be programmed correctly. If you don't do these two steps when you plug in the extension, it's just not going to work correctly. So first go and enable it. Go back in here. Launch a game from MAME. And you should be all set to go. All right, guys. I uh, hope this helps. And I'll see you guys in the next one.